Hello there everybody, my name is Roderick and this is my never ending back catalog of games and today's game is from the developer Orange Pixel which is a solo game dev making games since 2004. Um, the game we rolled last time was Heroes of Loot so that's what we're playing but apparently they also have done Gunslugs which I've heard of before and then a couple other games which I have not heard of, Ash World. That looks like uh, Ash from the Evil Dead series. Not going to lie, but hey, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, so yeah, the game we're playing today is Heroes of Loot. And as a lot of you know, I do play through these games and I uh, roll a random game at the end of the episode. Um, and that is what we decide to play next time. Anyways, Heroes of of Loots, released May 26, 2015. Mix reviews right now. That's okay. Let's play it. Okay, music's all right. Uh, take a look at the options menu here. Uh, full screen music, sound, dungeon difficulty, which it can't even select right now. <laughs> Probably because we don't even have a game ready. Um, so options are very, very bare bones. Um, we can choose to play as the Elf, the Warrior, the Wizard, the Valkyrie, or Locked, which uh, we have to reach dungeon level 30 to unlock. Um, I, I, I honestly don't know. Uh, it looks like Elf is the uh, the best like overall. So I guess we're going to go with the Elf. This dungeon looting could be the easiest job ever. We got an achievement, by the way. Um, okay. Whoa! Oh my god. How do I shoot? Oh my god. It is... Wow! It is very sensitive. It is very sensitive. It's very responsive. Oh my goodness. Look at all these uh, ghosts. Hello? Why is there just a hallway of, of, of... Oh! That guy was running at me super fast. What is this? Wait, is this all the loot? Diamondes? And, uh, Amethyst? Is that, is Amethyst, uh, the, uh, the purple diamond-like thing? Uh, I'm stuck in this corridor. What is going on here? Okay. Okay. Uh, oh my god. It is, it is so jittery. Oh, wow. The, it's kind of hurting my brain a little bit. Uh, you know what? This would really, really go well with the, um, the, the vampire survivors genre, where it auto-shoots for you. Oh yeah, look, we up, we leveled up and our, our arrow is now an actual arrow. Okay, I think we got all of the loot, I guess. Did we? Sure, I'm gonna go ahead and assume so. So onward to the next floor. Um... <laughs> Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> what is with look at the amount of enemies? They just they're just coming at you, man. Look, they they they're just com they're programmed only to come straight for you. So much so that they're stuck in the corners of the rooms they're in. That's wild. That's wild. You found a lightning rune? Oh my god! Is it gonna be like okay? Good. I was hoping it wasn't gonna be like that for the entire game because that would be really annoying uh so this is a kind of like a roguelike i guess a shop with all this loot we should be able to buy some great things hat i can use a new hat haha -ha. <laughs> buy a health potion for 50. is that all you have on sale is a health potion how do I talk to you? Oh, B opens up the menu here. Oh, I I left the dungeon. Continue save game. Yes. Oh, we're we're in a new dungeon. Okay, I press B twice and it just left. Very weird. Very weird. I I don't I don't know. I I I I I simply do not know. Oh well, <laughs> that's okay. There's a dude down there. There's a lot of dudes down here. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at the amount of enemies. Is is it supposed to be this many? We we unlocked we we got a, the key. Is there anything new at the shop? Uh, gems for 10? I don't know what that means, but I guess we bought gems for 10. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> oh, there's baddies over here. Interesting. All right, yeah, sure, we'll go to the next level. Oh! Oh! Oh, my goodness. 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 Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Okay. Wow. They were just on top of you, man. You, why do we spawn right in the middle of a giant horde of, of baddies? What? We got new ghosts. I guess the other ones were skeletons and these are ghosts? Ghost and ghouls? I don't know. We got the key. We can leave the level now. But of course, we gotta get all that loot, baby. We leveled up. Oh. Fire. Ooh! Okay. Let's, let's go to the next level. The fire rune does... Okay, so the magical runes... They're, they're on a time limit, but they do progress level to level. So that's pretty cool. There's a demon. There's demons now. Oh. There's, there's, there, there do be demons. Here, there be demons. I will say, oh my God. I will say, um, the lack of good AI kind of lets the game down because the enemies just run at you right like they're just they're simply programmed to run at you by the by the seams of it oh not even i don't even think one of the demons is supposed to be doing maybe it's just the basic enemies that just run at you there's a question mark here cool a quest door great way to earn extra Shh. the tax agency lives nearby that's funny Okay, what is this? Kill 55 imps. I will reward you a metal shield. Alright, so we have to kill 55 imps? We have to kill 55 imps in a minute 25? Okay. Oh. The dungeon is growing. We're attracting new monsters again. Keep it up in our difficulty. Oh god, I can't read that. All right, I have to go kill some imps, yo. I have to go kill some imps. I have to kill 51 imps. Ow, did I get hit? I guess I got hot. I got hit. Let's listen to the game audio for a bit, yeah? So I'm not going to get that kill 40 imps in 26 seconds. Oh. Buy a cloak for 250? Sure. Uh, we're invisible now? How long are we invisible? Are we just invisible forever? Interesting. Very interesting. We got new dungeon difficulty. There are bats now. Oh no, I don't like bats. <sighs> Look, the Batman symbol. Haha, <laughs> funny, funny. So how do, what is, what is, okay, so we have the invisibility cloak. Does that mean the enemies don't just charge at us now? I don't, I don't understand the significance of it. I'm, I'm guessing so. I'm guessing the enemies just simply don't charge anymore, which I guess is fine. We've unlocked the fire rune of destruction. I found a secret area. Oh my God. Do you see that? There's like a little a little walkway and huh how how cool I like I like secret areas in video games um now that I have the uh, invisibility cloak it feels like it'll be very hard for me to 
I was gonna say very hard for me to take damage and I, I instantly run into an enemy. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Ow, I ran right into an enemy again. Okay. All right. Listen here, punk. A diamond. Diomondes. Uh, where'd our invisibility go? We don't have the invisibility anymore. Uh, hi, can you guys help me? Sure. What's the problem? I'm in a cage. Oh, okay. Do you have a key? Mm, who is that guy? I don't know. We're on dungeon level 7. There's orange dudes now. There's bombs now. Thanks. I saved a lost soul. Oh my god. What is going on? That was our lightning rune, but look at our attack now. Since we're level 5, our attack is, is kind of crazy. Oh, the uh, the purple dude shoot at you. I think. I don't know. There's... Oh! I think we're getting shot at? Yeah, the purple dude shoot at you. Okay. Okay. So we have enemies that, that do more than just charge at you now. They, they shoot at you as well. Okay. Alright. Okay. Okay. Oh, everybody shoots at you now. It's, it's kind of hard to differentiate between the XP that's like flowing around me and my shots and their shots. It's 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 a little difficult. I'm not going to lie. It's it's a little difficult, yeah? 11 blue gems. Are these supposed to be blue? Oh no, those are blue. Listen, it's it's hard for me to actually see the colors. <laughs> It, it, it's very hard for me to actually see the colors. Um, they look very similar to me. So... Uh, oh my god, we're taking tons of damage here. Oh my god, it is so hard to see their shots. It is, it is, it is, it is... How am I supposed to dodge in that room? I don't know. Oh my god, I, I can't... The shots are too tiny and they're too fast. I can't see them. I, they're, they're too tiny and too fast. I can't see them. Oh my god! What is... They can shoot through the walls? Look! These guys are shooting through the walls at me. The guys are shooting through... They're literally shooting through the walls. Look at this. But I'm not taking damage? Oh no, I am taking damage. I'm just regening the damage they take? I take? I don't know. I have no idea. Buy a heart, sure. Why not? I'm just gonna buy everything I can. <laughs> Ow! I spawned right into damage. That seems a bit cruel. That seems a bit cruel. Um, we, we almost have the, uh, uh, we got, we did the quest. I, I don't know what I got for the quest. I, I wasn't, I didn't read it. But we, we did the quest. We, we did the quest. I have, I have no idea what's going on. I, I, I honestly, it's, 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 it's a mess. Honestly, it's a mess. I don't have enough money for that. Honestly, it's, it's a mess. I found a secret area. Oh, I got an invisibility cloak. Okay. How long do I have the invisibility cloak? The, uh, the dungeon has been upgraded. What are these things? Are they little maggot spawners? Why do they spawn me right next to it? Yeah, you, you, you destroy them and they blow up maggots in your face. <laughs> Let's get this quest, yeah? Blue gems. I can do blue gems. Oh my god. 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 Okay. Uh, <laughs> I was just kind of like running through it all. All willy-nilly like. To use this, he'll need... What? To use this well, you need the cup of life. Okay. Well, I don't have the cup of life. Unfortunately. 
<laughs> Do I even need to dodge? I, I'm just, I'm purposely taking damage now to see what happens. Are those traps? Oh, that's cool. Um, I can leave? Okay. Uh, I can leave. Are, are these, that supposed to be like a troll? Whoa. That's wild. Alright, let's see. Can we find any blue gems? There's no... Ah, there's big boys, though. My health is running low. <gasps> My health is actually running out. Wow. I'm surprised. I'll buy a wooden shield. Why not? We have a wooden shield now. Is that like a defense? Oh, look. These big dudes. I killed... Oh, it's a cyclops. Okay. I, I killed a cyclops, guys. I, I killed a Cyclops. I think our wooden shield also has run out. So there is that. And I, I we died. Okay, so there's the death. Um, we made it to X XP level 6, dungeon level 11. We slayed 624 monsters. Interesting. Let's go ahead and give uh, the warrior a shot. Yeah. Oh. Wait, what is... Oh. Okay, we... we So, we still throw stuff? I was hoping it would be melee-oriented, but it's still... We just throw the thing. Okay, well... um, Okay, so it's all projectile-based. That's that's fine. It's a twin-stick shooter, I guess. So, it's, it's understandable a little bit. Uh, quest, uh, c kill 50 skulls. So these are skulls? I see. It's a lot of skulls to kill, but you know what? They're coming right at me, so it's, it's nice and easy, I guess you could say. It's nice and easy to kill the 50 skulls. We're just gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna go as fast as we can. Oh, look, we can save people already? I guess we unlocked that ability. Um, okay. I, I don't know. I honestly, I have, I have no idea what I'm doing. Listen, listen here. If, if you think that I know what I'm doing, I don't. All right. You are sorely mistaken. I have not a clue on what's going on. What do we got here? The lens of secrets. Probably get to see through secret walls. Um, unfortunately, I do not have 300 gold at this point in time to do that. So, Ripperoni on the lens of secrets. Ripperoni on the lens of secrets. We'll just um, keep killing these skulls, I guess. Oh, are the runes based on the magic? Because that did not last very long. I see. So if I'm a wizard, the rune will last a very, very long time. That's my assumption based on how quick that fire rune ran out there. <laughs> That's um, my assumption. Oh, what is that? What? Oh, did we get the key somehow? Okay. Well, I, I thought it was a secret door, but I didn't realize I had gotten the key already. Interesting. Very, very interesting. So is it just a random enemy on the map has a key? Look at this, guys. They're just, they're just, they're just walking straight into the wall. They're just, they're, just, they're, they're not even trying to pathfind to me. They're just trying to get directly at me. It's a little, I don't know. It makes the AI not really fun to fight if, if they're just simply programmed to come at you directly, not even try to like go around the corner to get to you. Why am I missing? Oh, I, I thought I was shooting up, but I wasn't shooting up. Okay, well, whoa, experience scroll, item room, there we go, that's what I'm talking about. Why is it spawn us next to enemies? We leveled up though. That's pretty, pretty awesome. Oh my god, there's so many dudes down here. I'm also getting shot at through the wall again. Just a heads up. 
just as a, a heads up, I am indeed getting shot through the wall again. Look at this guy. <laughs> They're shooting me through the walls. It's no fun. All right, we got the key. Let's grab the money and get out of here. Next level. All right, we're just we're just gonna try to go as fast as possible. Yeah. Let's see how far we can get, and then we'll go and read some Steam reviews after that. We'll we'll, we'll try to get as far as possible, and then go and read some Steam reviews. Am I getting... I'm getting hit. I'm getting hit by people from the... On the other side of the wall. I can't shoot through the wall, but they can shoot through the wall. This is some bull, man. How am I supposed to dodge those attacks? You can't. <laughs> what? Like, there's nowhere to dodge there. Okay. All right. All right. Level design... Maybe a little too simple. Maybe a little too simple. There's a lot of dudes here. I'm I'm getting I'm getting shot through the wall. Okay, let's leave. We're running. We're running back. We're running back. We're running back, baby. Oh, let me grab that health and we're gonna go. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man. We're getting shot through the walls already. I repeat, we're getting shot through the walls already. Oh no. This is this is a terrible room to be in. I, I'm 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 taking damage through the walls, guys. I took damage through the walls there. Oh my god. Okay. We are very close to death. We are very, very close to death. There's there's not much we can do in this situation. Oh my god. 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 Come on. We got the small key. How do I get out? Oh my god. Lightning rune. Okay. We have to fight our way through this. Look at this. I can't. I leveled up. I leveled up. Okay. All right. I'm going to the shop. Whew. I... Yeah, I'll buy a metal shield. Why not? All right. Okay. We got an achievement as well. Our new attack is interesting looking. Oh, warrior found a secret. I found an invisibility cloak. Nice. Nice. Very cool. Oh my god. Traps. Oh my god. Traps. All right, we're just gonna we're just gonna wipe these guys out. Look at this. The invisibility cloak is nice. We can we can leave now. Okay. <sighs> Let's go and get out of here. Oh, secret or quest, not necessarily secret. Uh, five hapless peeps. What the heck is a hapless peep? I'm, I'm just gonna go. I, I, I don't know what a hapless peep is, but I have five minutes to kill five hapless peeps. Oh! Oh, they're people. It wants me to save people. Okay. Okay. All right. That's, that's fair. There's a person right there. I'm taking so much damage. I, I'm just... I, I'm, I'm taking... I'm taking just tons and tons of damage. What do we have here for sale? Potion? I don't think I need that. Okay. Oh my god. We got the key. We can leave. Um, I don't know where... The door? Where was the door at? It was up here. Okay, we're leaving. We're leaving. <laughs> the dungeons don't make any sense. I just start in the middle of a room. I, 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 I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going to run through here. All right. Oh, whoa! They're being summoned in? Do they normally get summoned in? Oh, we got the Cyclops here. Okay. 
I'm gonna go into the shop. Um, don't need that. Okay. We we killed the Cyclops. Uh, we're just gonna go through the next room. Oh my god. We we start getting shot at. We start getting shot at. We leveled up and we did. Okay. Well. Let's go and uh, take a look at some Steam reviews, yeah? Unlimited amount of randomly generated dungeons. Random quests, four classes, special fifth class to unlock for the real gamers. I guess I'm not a real gamer. Secret areas, special mysterious dungeon items, large collection of loot and items, always changing gameplay. Interesting. Uh, I love this game too much that I can't stop playing it. It has that one more go to that keeps on playing. Okay. Last week I decided to play it for only 15 minutes and played it for 70 minutes. The pixel art is so beautiful and the selling point is it's really fast paced, which I really like. I recommend this. A very casual shoot 'em up if you play the wizard. More enjoyable than I thought it would be. It's gauntlet only more pixelated and randomized, and you can only play co-op if you have multiple controllers. The keyboard and or mouse don't count, even though you can play the game with keyboard or mouse. If you really have trouble falling asleep, maybe get it on sale. What? That's okay. Neutral review, quick and fun, but unbalanced. Sometimes you will spawn in a room filled with enemies, which will insta-kill you. Uh, Heroes of Loot is very basic roguelike with dungeon crawler elements where your goal is to progress through the various levels of the game. You fight increasingly difficult monsters uh, along the way, ranging from little skulls that will barely hurt you to long-range fiery monsters that will be your doom on many a run. This game was ported from mobile devices. Oh, it's a mobile game. And while it may be fun to play on your phone and tablet, it does not meet the standards for a PC game. The settings are very simple and do not allow you to control much. To start off, the few options available are not very clear. They have unusual icon. Okay, that's a long review. Wow. Okay. He, didn't, he doesn't recommend the game. The game has all the right premise uh, to be awesome. It's gauntlet-like twin-stick shooter filled with humor with captivating polished pixel graphics and nice music. Sadly, it misses all the most important points. The gameplay is non-existent. At, as most of the time, you are shooting enemies down a corridor with no space for dodging and a single direction for shooting. When you see it, it moving, the game looks like it's trying hard to cause epilepsy with the square-based dynamic lighting and the continuous screen-shaking effects. You are continuously surrounded by the useless blue particles that represent experience points and by your own huge bullets. As a result, you cannot see enemy bullets! And sometimes even enemies. Finally, the game is extremely repetitive, and after one hour, you've seen almost all it has to offer. That's what I experienced, and I played it for like 20 minutes. Um, I'm kind of curious to see what the other game is like. Oh my god, that looks so much better. Right? Like, that looks like way more... Look, there's a map even. Look at the UI on the second game. Wow, look at this! Huh! Oh my god, the second game's sitting at mostly positive review. Mm. Now you compare you compare that to the first game, you get this. The huge di difference. Huge difference. Um the second game was only a year later later and it, it looks so much better hmm wow skip the first game go for the second game yes that's that's what i'm seeing right skip the first game go for the second game even the enemies look better you still get the oh look you get melee oh <gasps> the person melees i like i like melee look it's the barbarian they're twirling look at this oh my god the second game looks way better Guys, don't get the first game. Get the second game. Even just looking at it like from right there, I can I can I can clearly tell the second game is way better. The second game is just way better. All right. Well, anyways, that was Heroes of Loot two. Let's go and start. No, that was Heroes of Loot one. <laughs> I did not play Heroes of Loot two. Let's go and find out what we're playing next time. 
All right, everybody, it's time to find out what random game we're playing next time. And it is Prison Architects. Oh, no, this is a super in-depth game, but I'll do it. <laughs> I'll do it. I tried playing this before, and I, I couldn't I couldn't get into it. I couldn't get into it for, for whatever reason. I couldn't get into it. But, um... We'll play it now, yeah? We'll uh, we'll play it next time. Let's go, Prison Architect. Welcome, Wardens! Only the world's most ruthless warden can contain the world's most ruthless inmates. Design and develop your personalized penitentiary in Prison Architects. We make a prison. Uh, it looks very RimWorld-esque. I have played RimWorld since I played Prison Architect last. So maybe I'll like it. Maybe I'll like it now. Is it... It looks exactly like RimWorld, actually. Is it, is it made by the same people? Hold on. They are not made by the same people. The developers of Prison Architect are Double Eleven and IntroVision Software. And the developers for RimWorld are Ludian Studios. But they look like they look so similar. Not in those, not, not in those images, but like... When they were building the, the stuff and putting things down, it looks, it looks so similar. Weird. Like, even the character models kind of look similar. Weird. Yeah, this is like... These are... What? Oh no, they're they're different. Okay. Mm. All right. Interesting. <laughs> well, uh, I've played some Rim World. I've apparently I've played twenty hours of Prison Architect. I don't think that's true. I think I think I might have left it on. But yeah, next time we're playing Prison Architect.